Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name's Duena. Thank you so much for being here. But it feels like I've been going off YouTube for a hot minute, even though it was just last Sunday. But it just seemed like it's been forever since I did a video. So on today's episode of things that I did not need, but I purchased anyway, I have some things from Bell's. They used to be Burke's Outlet, Ross, Hobby Lobby, and of course, Home Goods. Now, Home Goods, mm, I don't know what's going on with Home Goods. I don't know if it's mad with me because I said it was trash in my last couple videos, but sorry, I do apologize. I want to apologize to Home Goods because it seemed like when I'm going, they really ain't been having nothing. Mm, I, I don't know what's going on with Home Goods. I need y'all to get it together. Now, I apologize. I said I was sorry <laughs> for trash talking. So please bring back some good stuff now. Granted, they have been having some amazing pieces, but for somebody else, not for me. For somebody else, not for me. So yeah, so again, Saudi, <laughs> bring back some good pieces. I don't know what's going in. Maybe I'm going at the wrong time, but hell, I try to go in the morning, the, not in the evening, but the morning <laughs> before 12, so I, I Maybe I'm missing it. I don't know. Okay, but let's get right into this haul because you know how I am. But guys, I've missed you. Like for real though, I have. So let's get into this Hobby Lobby because of course, more stems like I needed them. I don't know who this new me is. I wasn't into throw pillars or stems. Now, <laughs> I got a problem. Okay. Okay, my first stems are these right here. I got... One, two, three, four, five. How many I got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. They're going on my coffee table. And I'll insert a picture here or there or whatever. But that color. And I wanted something like dark and moody. Even though it's not picking up on camera. But if you've seen these in person, they're actually like a little fuchsia pink color. With a little dark. Now, I hate like the green and stuff like that. You know me, I may end up spritzing it kind of black just to give it a, like a goth color. Not goth because I'm not that, but I do want this area to be kind of dark. So I'm going to spritz it because that is taking a whole vibe from that. They should have had darker stems, like a darker brown or something like that to where it don't look as cheap. But on the table, they don't look cheap. That makes a difference. But have you noticed with Hobby Lobby, you do have to look at their prices because I have noticed I had to get more of these because initially I had just got three and they were $7.99. But then when I went to get the other four, because I told you I'm an odd type girl, it's got to be odd numbers for me. But when I went to get the other ones, they actually was $10.99 and I bought them like a fool and I was like, dang, why my total so high? So I ended up getting home, putting them within. I was like, wait a minute. I know you lying. I paid $10.99 and the first ones I paid $7.99. Of course, they went back. <laughs> and then just my luck, the next week they wasn't on sale. So I had to wait a whole nother week. Went back and thank God they had the four that I needed. Because I looked through and made sure they were $7.99 before I actually returned them. Okay, enough. <laughs> so yeah, that's that. So gorgeous. And then I just mix, I got three of these and I just mix that in with that. And I do like the leaves on this one. So, and I just thought it would give it like a, I don't know, like when you see it, you, you'll see what I'm going, going with. But hey, probably the next time you see the vase, these may be sprayed. So ugh. I'm just going to sit that there, that. And then I ended up getting three more of these. And I'll insert a picture here, what I did in my bedroom. I just wanted it more fuller. When I was telling you guys about these right here, when if you haven't seen that video of me making over my room, then go check it out. Not wait, go check it out. So yeah, these are the sims that I was telling you about. I know you probably seen them and just didn't think nothing of it because they do look cheap up close. When you first see them, you're like, I don't know about them, shawty. <laughs> but yeah, when you get them, like pull them out, like, oh. and you just pull them apart, of course. Look how that look. That actually look like a twig, like a branch. So 
you'll actually, like I said, you'll see it full, cause I just wanted it fuller. So that's that. And then these next ones, they came in a set of three in the dried area. I don't know why I got them. I kind of like it because it's a dried thing or whatever, but like I forgot how much these was. Oh shoot. Okay, the fuchsia ones were $7.99. Yes, I told you, $7.99. And then the little, which ones I think was $7.99 or $6.99. But the other black one, I think that was, sorry, <laughs> I don't know. Okay, and these you'll see when I redecorate like my kitchen countertop and I got a little corner, you'll actually see that probably in the next video. But I got these little carnation. Now they actually, they feel really good. The color, I wanted something. I told you I'm into pinks and chocolate browns right now. I don't know what it is, but those colors right there are just doing it for me. But yeah, these were $5.99, of course, they were half off that. So I ended up getting five and you'll see, cause I actually, let me show you. I'm going to curl it and have it Cause you can bend them and then I'll have it like Hank, you actually get to see that. So I put something over here so you can see how it's going to look. But yeah, that's that. That's the only thing that I got from Hobby Lobby. Now let's move on to the store called Bells. Like I said, it used to be Burke's outlet, but now guys, you remember I was telling you about the bees. I wanted the blue ones. You remember the green ones that I got on, on the stick and I was like, uh, such a waste. The stick, I ended up taking them off. I ended up finding, look at that blue. Oh, yes, yes, yes. I ended up getting these for four, how much are those? Come on now. How much are you lying? $16.99. Yeah, because if I would have got these at Home Goods, they would have been either $29.99 or $19.99. With the stick, they would have been $29.99. And without, they would have been $19.99. So $16.99 when sorted. Okay, then I actually got this little espresso pod thing. I'll insert a clip so you can actually see what I had them in originally and then how they look now. So I got that because the bowl that I had my pods in was taking up way too much room. I don't have a lot of counter space as it is, so I have to kind of maximize it. And at first I was like, oh, the silver, it was like just clashed because my handles are gold on the cabinets. But then I'm like, the Nespresso machine is black and silver, so it blended right in. So enough about that. Now this was $9.99. It's actually pretty good and it holds, let's say it's 20 and 30. It depends on what size you have. So that was a little great little find. Now I'll actually show you that. Put that there. And what else I got? Okay, from Bell. And this is just personal stuff. Not really personal, but I told you, this is just not a home decor. Um, so, <laughs> this is just not a home decor. Uh, God dog it, I just channel. Wow, do you guys ever get, <laughs> do that? Like just lose thought? Baby, I've been getting to sleep, so I don't know what's going on. But yeah, this is just not a home decor channel. This is a lifestyle. So I will add personal stuff in from time to time. So yeah, I got these little foot masks. I love to do like the whole little face mask and the foot and stuff. It used to be a time like me, my mom, and my daughter, we would all have face masks on. Like, just have like a little girl's night. And we need to start back doing that. So, hey, I ended up getting two boxes of these. I've never tried the mint and tea tree. So, I got two of those. No, I lied. Sorry. I got the lavender one. Because I am a fan of lavender. Love it. So, but lavender vanilla is my jam. So I ended up getting two of those. And then, I hate that I gotta throw stuff down, hate it. Then I ended up getting two dresses 
that I need to try. But just nice little spring, summer thing, whatever, because, but what got me what the, was the buttons, honey. That split needs to be a little bit, what do you mean, up here somewhere. <laughs> I had to look how far it went up. Yeah, my split needs to be. If I'm trying to show my ham hocks, I don't know what y'all talking about. I ain't trying to show my cooter, but I'm trying to show these ham hocks. But yeah, the split could have came up here. But I love that. I thought that was cute. So, so my husband is coming home the end of this month. So we get to go out on the outings, and I like that line. That color will look so good on my skin tone. So that's the only why I got this, no buttons or anything like that. But I just got that because of the color, I think. And I don't have anything this color, this green. So, got that. So let's move right along to Ross and then what happens to home goods. Now, Ross does pretty much nothing for me. The two that I go to. I, I've been seeing some good stuff on other people's channel, but my two... I never look. I always look, but I never find anything. It's rare if I buy something out of Ross Home Decor related. So I ended up getting two of these. Now, I know you're probably looking like, girl, why? <laughs> Let me show you up close. Like, so, you see these little things right here? That is the only reason why I bought these. They were $9.99. And when I was checking I out, they redecorate. I was like, nah, I just want the little brown ones out of it. He said, are you serious? You buying it just for the little, mm-hmm. My mom, hey, it's not going to go to use. It's not going to go to waste. My mom will get the rest of it. I just wanted these little brown ones right here. And maybe the little pink, because pink is my color right now. Probably the little pink flowers. But yeah, all this that can keep. So I ended up getting two only because of the LeBron things. That came from Ross. And again, as the people say, health is well. I used to take this brand Goalie, like back in the day. I used to take it faithfully and then I just fell off like a bad bag of dope. I don't know why or how, but I need to store it back because I do work out and I kind of eat balanced. I pretty much intimate fast. I try to eat, my earliest meal is like at 3.30, but I try to stretch it to five. And then I cut it off at nine. Only because what I'm going through with this eczema and psoriasis so bad on my hand and my feet. So it's like I'm trying to retrain my gut because all that food and is not being properly digest, gonna be doing my research. So I'm trying to send my body into autophagy. So that's why I eat so late. But yeah, so I said I was going to be, um, going to start back taking these and they're actually, my neighbor's passing by. So these are apple cider vinegar ones and the green ones are the super greens. And the only reason why I got them cause I really don't care for gummies cause of extra sugar was because these were $3.49. And if you know about this brand, they're pricey. So I was like, $3.49? And these guys, I could not believe, were $7.99. I ended up getting two. They only had two, I ended up getting them. So I was like, now if you see these, cause it's 120, I've seen them for $29.99. Like a pharmacist or something like that. Every now and then you can find them at Home Goods too. And it used to be $19.99, but before inflation. So, of course, they probably $29.99. So, that's the only reason why I got those. And that's another update. I forgot to tell you, I forgot to show these two to you that I got from Ross. The bigger one was $90 something, dollars, and the smaller one was $54.99. But my son ended up getting the bigger one at first. Cause I saw the smaller one and I was like, oh, I needed another, another luggage. So I ended up getting that one and he had this one getting ready to go on his trip. And I was like, no, I want that, I want that. So he gave me that one and I just bought him another one. So I just love the detailing on that. 
even though my kids hated Disney, they went one time and one time only. It was just too much. It was the lines was too long. It was boring. So we vowed never to go back. We love to go to Universal Studios, um, any Six Flags, water parks, fairs, or anything like that. But Disney was just not for us. So yeah, so I ended up getting these. And let me show you. The back is just plain, so. And I'll look at these walls because I am getting ready to paint. So the back is just that. And I wanted an all black suitcase. So that was why I needed that. My son was so sweet. He ended up giving me his and took mine. And I don't know the brand, so don't ask me to pronounce it, honey. So back to the schedule program. Yeah. So now the rest of the stuff is from Home Goods. So let's get right into it. Okay. I was just in there the other day. And this is the only thing that I found. What? How stinking cute is this? This is what, of course, I'm going to spray paint this black. I cannot do this color. Oh, sorry, I can't. But I love the fact that this is actually like that little amber color. You can't really see it on camera, but it's like a very light amber color. But I was like, I like this. This remind me of Willow, like the first Willow, and then also the Lord of the Rings. I don't know why this little it's giving me lord of the rings of the first willow so i thought that was super cute and it's heavy the next piece that i got i have been eyeing this face for about i want to say two months i've seen it but i wish it was way bigger the only reason why i got it because it's like a little sparkly i like that though and this was $16.99. And let's see how this will look. The bucket. Can you see? Of course I'm not putting it right on this shelf, but it gives a good a good look. Okay. Now the next thing that I got was I don't know why, don't know how, but it's giving very sculptural. It's not it's not heavy. That's the only thing I hate about it because it's not heavy. But yeah, but I like it. It's different. And this was, how much was you? $19.99. So you probably can't see that, but let me move my stomach. I think that's cute. I'm feeling it. But yeah. Okay, let's get back off of the two. Whew, watch my fanny. Of course, guys, you know I am a candle, candle freak. Even though I don't need another candle, and I don't. If you haven't seen one of my videos with my candle collection, then go back. I can't tell you which video because I forgot. It's the one where I redecorated the second shelf. I do know. The only reason why I got this candle because it was $7.99. It is... The honey and sandalwood, but it smells so good. It's like a powdery scent, like a very clean powdery scent. Oh, it smells so I hope it smells like this as it's burning. And it's very, I like it because it don't have any words to it. It's very neutral. Like I said, this was seven dollars. Now I've seen it in other um home um I'm gonna say Home Depot. Home Depot must be talking about me. I was home goods. I was, they're still regular price for $16.99, but I got it for seven. And then I got his cousin, this lavender and eucalyptus. And I love these two scents. This one really don't smell, smell. It's like a hint of lavender. I don't smell the eucalyptus at all, but hey, I'm not mad at it. For $7, I'm not, but yeah. So then I found this today. This is my favorite like linen spray. 
You can spray it on your couch, your linen, your rugs, your curtains, your shower curtains, whatever. It's just a refreshing up your space. And I love the lavender vanilla. If you ever see this brand, smell it. I, I hate when I say smell it. <laughs> it sounds so, smell it. But I love this one. Oh my goodness, this is my favorite. And you, I really don't see this brand that often. So when I see it, if they have multiples, I always get it. So they had three. I ended up getting the whole three. And my last, no, my last two items. Okay, again, this was the only thing that I, well, three things that I found today. Was this, oh my goodness. The textural, the textural, the texture. so good and this was $39.99 and it's made from Vietnam Vietnam Nam, however which way you said hmm I'm trying to see what it's made out of because I feel like it's almost coral that's how it feels to me like it's made out of um, corals I was trying to see hmm what a Mm, it ain't giving me nothing. Okay, the last thing that I got was pillows. I don't know who this girl is. Duena, what did you do to the old you? Like, what's going on, girl? Ooh, what you got going on? Okay, I got these to go on this little futon couch thing that I'm going to put in my office once I redo it. Can you see this? I hope you can see it. These things feel so good. Oh my goodness. If you see this, oh, it's like 98% um, 90, duck feather and then 2% down. Now, I hope these feathers won't come out because the black ones on my couch, the feathers come out so bad. That's the only thing I hate about it because the feathers come out so bad. But yeah, this is, it, oh, it feels so good. And if you're into that whole chopping pillow thing, I'm not. But if you're into that, then it's perfect. Like, you can actually. Either they're going to design on the front and nothing on the back. I hate pillows like that. I don't understand why people make those like that. What if you get a stain or anything on it? You can't flip it because they have, like, the little plain side. I hate that. But, yeah, I ended up getting three of these. At first, I was like, should I put these on my bed? But I'm going to put them on this couch that I'm redoing my office. So, you guys to come along for that. And I'm, the couch is actually black. It's a futon couch. It's like suede material. So, this will be perfect on it. And I think it will just make that black pop. So, I ended up getting these. And these are 98% duck feather and 2%. And the brand name is... Costello, I'm assuming, home or whatever. So yeah, but these were perfect. I don't understand who I am right now. I don't get down with throw pillows. You guys know that I've said it, stated it. Just not me. But lately, since I've been on YouTube, I, I don't know who I am anymore. Who is this new me? But I would never be steaming a bed or probably curtains. I'm not going to say curtains because I do want linen curtains. I want real linen curtains. So if they come real too wrinkled, I may have to like buff that out. But a bed could never. <laughs> okay, guys. Thank you so much for spending a little time with me. It's been a long time. I feel like it's been forever. It's only been a short period. Oh, please don't forget to like, share me, comment, subscribe. Come on now. Thank you guys. I'll see you later. I'll catch you on my next one. Bye.